Piku. Piku. In- indeed. Piku. 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 Are you exhausted yet? <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions, idiots. I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. And this is a movie reaction. Dun, dun, dun! Uh, we uh, watched a film called A Piku. Yeah. Well, not A Piku, but just Piku. Piku. Uh, directed by, uh, I want to say her name, or his name, sorry. Shuzit. Shuzit Sirkar? Yeah, who also directed Pink. Mm hmm. Uh, and the, it's starring, obviously, Topeka, Amatak Bakchan. And Irfan. Irfan Khan. Who, did you notice in the opening credits, he was just billed as Irfan? Really? There was no Khan. It was just Irfan. Interesting. Yeah. Like Shri Devi. Right. I don't, I don't know, her I don't know what that was about. Last oh, yeah, she does. Oh, does she? Yeah, in fact, her, her first name isn't Shri Devi. It's a combination of, of, of two. Her first name was Shri, and I think just that. Close. Oh. But anyway. Uh, and the, the synopsis is a quirky comedy about the relationship between daughter and her aging father, who's... Eccentricities? Eccentricities. Drive everyone yes. crazy. Oh, by the way, she should probably, if you're gonna see this movie, you probably wanna like step outside because it'll be spoiled for you. It'll be ruined for you if you hear this. I'm glad I remembered that. Okay, sorry. Bye, Alexis. Bye. And this will be obviously a complete spoiler review as all of ours are. As all of If you haven't watched it, please go watch it and come back. And if we didn't, well, that's kind of a hint at the front. If we didn't like it, we wouldn't tell you to waste your time to go watch it. We would just yes. say stick around and just listen to yes. what we have to say. It's a very interesting film. Um, but I ended up enjoying it. And I, I ended up loving it. Yes. And here, here's, here's why it was interesting to me. Yeah. At first, I'm like, God, I am exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> because of the film or just the amount of work you're having to do? No, and both. <laughs> <laughs> because, um, especially the first 20 minutes, the, especially the way they cut it, yeah. it was like, uh, cut, 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 and it was just it, full dialogue over and over again, everybody talking over each other, and then uh, it, and when basically when Piku's character was like, uh, I think she said, like, I, I need a break, yeah. and then it kind of slowed down, and I was like, oh, that was on purpose. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Right. That was on purpose. The director did that. So the director on purpose wanted you to feel like Piku's character. Absolutely. freaking lutely They wanted you to feel exhausted yep. with the amount of just over-talking, like talking about one thing over and over and over again. Yeah. Uh, and That's both the script did that and yeah. the direction. Yeah, and the, and the editing. And after I realized that, I was like, that's actually pretty brilliant. Brilliant. And, and it was... But uh, my favorite part about this, and we could get into more of it, was Amitak Bakchan's character. Mm -hmm. God. Man, you and he was like so freaking annoying, but I loved him so I know. much. <laughs> I know. I, I, that's great. It made you feel like she did. On the one yes. hand, you're irritated by the guy so much, yeah. but you still find him quite endearing. Yeah, and I could not do what Piku did. Like, no, you could and, never do that. At all. Thank, no way. Thank God my parents aren't like that. No, all. no. You would, you would like desert them. Peace out. Yeah. <laughs> Take care Later, of yourself. Take Go care away. Yourself. Uh, hire, hire a nurse. Yes. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it, and then uh, so, what did you think of the the whole thing? I, I just, I just, I loved it. Mm -hmm. um, I, the thing, I think, what I loved the most because there's a, there is a whole lot I loved about this is. Uh, what I loved, if, if I was going to, if I was teaching theater again, yeah, mm -hmm. I would tell everybody in the class, if you want to see how to act, you should watch this because what you're going to get, bunch of you're, you're not going to get a character like the Joker with Heath Ledger. Yeah. You're not going to get these moments like... Uh, in There Will Be Blood, the whole, um, uh... He drank my milk? Yeah, you're not gonna get a, yeah. the, the, I drink your milk. Yeah, that's right. Or the, I am the, you're not gonna get any of that. Mm -hmm. What you're gonna get is, for me, we just people. the beauty of them doing nothing. Yep. It's a, it's a, it's a very fly on the wall film. Just the, the, all of them, everybody, including the small roles, was just 
and the, the director let them all breathe. I, I bet the, the, the feeling on set was just so conducive to the actors just being able to be themselves. The hardest thing for an actor to do is not act. Mm -hmm. And that's the goal of acting, is to just be. Mm -hmm. And there was never a moment where I didn't think any of these people were just being. He is. A, the he whole is time. a very, I think, actor's director. One hundred percent. Because he did Pink. Yeah. And that exact. The, that's the exact same way that film was. And I, was, there's no way Big B would do two films with the same director if he wasn't happy yeah. with the director. Yeah. No and way. Obviously, this is the most different we've seen Big B. Yeah. Outside in, in a film, I so we saw him in Chalet and we didn't even recognize him, but um, we we. And he's uh, always been strong and heavy and yeah. powerful. But he was like. I mean, he still had a presence, obviously, because yeah. that's him. Yeah. But he had, like, he was so quirky mm -hmm. and... And scary. Hypochondriac. Yeah. Legit hypochondriac. Hypochondriac. Um, <laughs> he was so funny in a lot of... Like, when he was, like... <laughs> when he was... The guy came up and he was trying to talk to Topeka's character. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. That's like, like, the first, she's had, she's, she had multiple sexual... Multiple parties. sexual... She's not a virgin, you know. <laughs> I'm like, oh no, he uh, didn't just say that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I love that, his whole character. And then when they incorporated Irfan Khan, and I thought that was a great addition because it was just like watching he at, see? Yeah. That was a great idea. That was a great idea. Uh, but uh, when he came in, he, he was almost us. Mm -hmm. Right. The outside looking yeah. in. Yeah. Yeah. And, and he was like, uh, <laughs> are you. How do you deal with him? Like, is every conversation about right. poop? Well, and even <laughs> even her. He yeah. had to deal with her being so rude. Yeah. Um, I understand why, though. I mean... Oh, yeah. I do, too. I felt so... It was a weird ending, because I felt so relieved for her. Uh, oh, let's talk about the end. Yeah. I felt so relieved for her, but it's also her dad, and you know that she loved him, uh, and she, like, she, she would never wish he wasn't around of course but she was still like she couldn't live her life and she couldn't just be her own person because he was a very selfish and controlling person true but the great conversation she has with Irfan when they're talking about and she points out uh, he he points out well I, I, I'm not I'm not casting aspersions upon you I live with my mom I'm not saying that living with your parent in and of itself is wrong just you shouldn't feel this obviously it's it's screwing with your life yeah and making you a more negative person and that's the one of the other things I loved so much about the movie so much was said that was never said which for screenwriting that's so hard to do and it's what needs to be done we didn't get a lot of answers about Irfan's family we didn't find out much about his dad other than when when Big B's character starts telling him you tortured your dad yeah that was intense <laughs> oh yeah and you could see that was that was going re I love that we never got to hear him talk about his dad. Mm -hmm. Why does he live with his... Why did he take over the family business? Yeah, he, we didn't get those answers. He put on a great performance, and it was a very understated performance. As always with that man. Yeah. I um, adore that guy. Yeah. I just... He's so beautifully small. He doesn't need to perform. And all of them are such great listeners. Oh, yeah. And... Okay. So, Depika. Mm-hmm. I knew this about her, I assumed it, especially after watching Priyanka that in, in Barfi, that there was a weightiness and a depth to her as an artist that we really haven't gotten to see yet and what we've seen her do. We've think, seen her do good work. I think we saw her in, um, the, the, was it Pastrami? She was great. Uh, she hasn't done bad work. Yeah. But this. You think this was her best? Unquestionably. Uh, I, I think it was... Um, Unquestionably for me. The best one I think I've seen is... Uh, she was great in this, no doubt. But uh, pastrami and uh, no, for me and Padmavat both. I I would still pick those over this. This for me was oh, it wasn't as revelatory for me as watching Priyanka and Barfi, mm -hmm. but for me, I saw for the first time, and I'm so excited now for her new film that'll come out in January. Mm -hmm. uh, of she plays the the girl who I believe was burned. Mm -hmm. um, this is this is an actress who I think can easily like Priyanka be completely passed over simply because she's so pretty. Mm -hmm. And you lose the reality that this is a very deep, if she's not trained, I'm flabbergasted. Mm -hmm. Again, she, think about what I'm about to say. Mm -hmm. She matched Big B and Irfan mm -hmm. on screen with her stillness, her quiet, I her, never, she didn't need to perform. I never, she was thinking about what she was gonna say. I never doubted that. Oh, 
I just, I just, I found her to be. I saw all that in the, so good pastrami and Padma. Yeah, again, I, she was really, really good in those. But yeah. for me, I didn't see a thespian emerge. Oh, I did until this. Mm -hmm. This for me was watching three master thespians surrounded by a supporting cast that the director and the casting director did a beautiful, beautiful job for everybody in the in the movie mm -hmm. of just. Absolutely exquisite acting and a, a really, really great screenplay. I guess I got there before you. Where <laughs> that, that thing? Oh, for like three thespian act. I, I I knew that going in. Like that's what I was expecting. Yeah. I, I I think I had already put her on that level that you hadn't put her on yet. Maybe so. You had <laughs> put her on Priyanka's level. Oh yeah. Okay, I hadn't done that yet. Yeah, because I actually I'd seen her be good, but I hadn't seen anything that for me. Was I know a lot of transcendent. Because I know a lot of y'all in what was it uh, pastrami, right? Yeah. That's yes. the one where she plays the. That's 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 where she is the love interest, and she's fighting with the yes. baby in her arm. That's right. Uh, I thought she outshined Priyanka in that. I know a lot of people. Yeah, I thought uh, Priyanka was better, but yeah, I no offense to who was good in it, but for me, Priyanka I thought, stole the show. I thought Topeka was better in that, and so like right. So I see. What I, you're I, I was kind of already there. I see. What you're I thought she. I think she's an amazing actress. But oh, yeah, sure. this film. Um, it's so funny because a lot of times I felt like a lot of the characters, like when. Irfan went to, she was, I think, sitting on the lake or wherever, the water. Uh-huh. And he went and to talk to her. And he went to talk to her, and she was like, can we just sit in silence? And I was like, yes. Please do. Please do for like five minutes in the, in the movie. Because <laughs> yeah. I need a break as well. Yeah. <laughs> for, I, I totally felt, relate. I felt like that so many times. And, and let's, you mentioned the ending. Let's go back to the ending. I thought the ending couldn't have been better, where they're, they're playing, mm -hmm. and the... the oh, yeah. The helper comes. I didn't know what she was going to do. Didn't know what she was going to do. But that little comeback tomorrow with her playing with him was enough to let you know she's changed and you get to decide how you think this story's going to end. Are they mm -hmm. going to get married? Yep. I think they are. I'd like to hope they are because they seem to be pretty good for each other. I didn't care. Um, but I didn't care if they did or didn't. I love that they just ended it without having to tie anything in a bow. They didn't have to consummate their romance with each other. There didn't have to be a big kiss or a love or a, a, just this and little glances that she began to change. Even the smallness of the way she looked at him began mm -hmm. to change, um, which is only internal work that an actor does. You can't indicate those things. If you indicate those things, you're acting and it's false. It doesn't mm -hmm. come across as believable. Yeah. And that's what blew me away was how much of her work was so natural, no indicating. I expect that from Irfan and, and Big B. But I didn't expect her to be as brilliant as she was. Mm -hmm. And I just, I love, love, love this movie. Yeah, it was a great movie. And I think I would enjoy it even more second time. Yep, for sure. Because I already know kind of what's going on. And so I don't have to, because I think it was even more exhausting for us. To, it'd be one thing. Read. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It'd be one thing if you spoke the language and you could just yeah. watch, watch them. And you, right. you, you kind of know what they're saying. We had to watch them and read, and there was a lot of words. It is torturous. Real, real fast. It is torturous because when they're speaking, you want to be looking in their eyes and yeah. in their face, and you you gotta you gotta go quick da, 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 up and down. Yeah. And so uh, it's even more exhausting. And yeah. So I even felt I think more like Topeka from having to. Oh, I'm tired of well, reading. <laughs> and and there's other cultural references as well that I'm sure we didn't find the full impact yeah. on, like being Bengali or not being Bengali. Yeah. And I'll tell you what, we've talked about what are things, like what roles we would like to do. Mm -hmm. Like clearly what are the what would be right for us. Mm -hmm. I would not only like to play Irfan's role. Oh yeah. I would love to see this film made as an American film taking it solely in the because the subject matter, you caught the metaphor of the constipation, obviously. Yeah. And I would love to see just a guy who owns a taxi company with a girl taking care of her dad and maybe they live in LA but their home is in Boston and this guy who owns the taxi company was from New York and they drive cross country with the dad and you could take so much of what's inherent in this and apply it and turn it into a story with Americans doing what they're doing and having American cultural references. I think just it's a just a fantastic yeah. movie. Yeah, I, I, I think it, how, how many stupids would you give it? it? This was as good for me as English English. So I'd give it a 10. Oh, you think so? It, yeah, it's well, totally the, different. The reason, yeah, very different. But for, this one's more like the awards, honestly. Like I, I This just, could enter, yeah, this could enter awards level. Like, this was like, remember Manchester you by the Sea? Yeah. Uh, I know you didn't like that film, yeah. but it was very similar in that it was like a fly on the wall film. And that's what I'm talking about. Very much. Um, and so, like, and the, all the acting was top notch. 
Uh, yeah. So that's what I'm saying. It could be like one of those types of films. Correct. Yeah. Um, For as opposed to English Finglish, right. you could literally pop on at any second. Yeah. You're always going to be in the mood for that. Always. I, um, I would have to be in the right mood yeah, to watch that's this. Why, that's why I think for I'm, sure. I'd probably give this about a 8.59. Yeah. It's, for me, it's still a 10, for, 10. Its, for its type of film. Yeah. For me, it's, again, it's a film that if I were to point to people to... I love, I mean, some of my favorite scenes are to point out of anything done by Meryl Streep and Daniel Day-Lewis and Tom Hardy. We could go through hundreds of scenes mm. that are just riveting. Mm. This would probably be my favorite movie to show scenes of, of you want to know how to act? Just mm. watch these guys listen to each other. Mm -hmm. Watch them say nothing. Mm. Watch them just sit. Like, there's a moment where Irfan is sitting on the side of the road and he's just watching them. Mm. And that's all the director caught was him sitting on the side of the road. That's it's so hard to capture that and not, yep, and look not like look acting. like you're acting. It's those no, moments. I love the moment when <laughs> he wanted him to throw the knife and he didn't want to throw the knife, and so they both just sat yeah. down. <laughs> and I, you know what I thought? I thought, you know, the screenwriter in my head is going, "We're gonna come back to that knife and we're gonna find out that knife had some really important meaning to him for some reason. Maybe it belonged to his dad." Uh, they never brought it back to that. We don't know why that thing was there. Yeah, it was just, it, it was great fly on the wall film. Love it. I thought the director did a masterful job a masterful of making job. you feel exhausted. Yeah, just, just like, like her. America. <laughs> yeah. And, I, I, and I, just I, like Irfan. Yeah, and it was genius because not a lot of films, because it's dangerous, because you could just end up being like, you're just exhausted. I hate this film. And you I push your audience it. away. Yeah. yeah. And so it was a masterful job yeah. by, uh, by sh say his name for me. Yeah, by, uh, Shinji, I can't read it fully. Blow it up here. Shujit Sikhar. Okay. Yeah. Shujit Sikhar. Well, we loved Pink. Yeah. We loved this. You're, you're an amazing director. Amazing director. Please cast us in your next film. Yes, thank you. <laughs>